goats back in the long drive. We, we, okay. We're lost. hundred percent. Um, there's only two ways I think we can go. I'm going to stand up here. I was having a little bit of breakfast. Um, how are you guys doing by the way? I hope you're doing great. Um, here's what I figure. I put the draw distance up to 25 kilometers. I still can't see the road. So what I'm hoping I can do is sleep uh, while in, and then, cause it'll show the outside view and okay. There's only two ways I can go. Either I came from this way. Cause there's that big rock that I went by or I came from that way. And that's the rock I came by. I don't know which one's which I haven't zoomed out as far as it goes to see if I can see anything. But I think what I'm going to do is oh, I can't sleep. Yet. I was hoping to be able to get to nighttime and then take a look. But my only option I figure is, um, I got to pick one direction and go for it. And I got to go in a straight line and see. So I went that way last time, about three kilometers, well, about a kilometer and a half actually, because that's how far the odometer said. But I think I got to go further. And I think I see something out there on the horizon, maybe. It's hard to tell. Like I said, the frame rate is going to go to crap because I'm at a 25 kilometer draw distance. But we're going to head that way and see. And we're going to go in a straight line. So if we do get lost, we uh, can find it back this way. And this thing is not driving worth Oh, wait a minute. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, hang on a sec. Before I go anywhere, this thing is dragging all over the ground, this engine. So we're going to take these big ass tires here. And I think there's, a, I think I saw another one. Oh, there's, that's a bus tire. It's, we don't have any ability to use the bus tire, but we do have. Uh, okay, there we go. Okay. We, okay, where did, where did I see that? Was it up on this roof? Maybe maybe it was over here. I thought I saw another uh, Fury wheel. Ugh. Maybe. Oh, there it is. Right there. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh, there's a sled up here. Nice. Um, So I'm going to go over here. Okay. Can, is there any way up here without having to go get a board? Yeah, we're going to have to get a board. We're going to grab that tire down from up there. Fix it all up. Put it on the front of this thing and see if we can't get it off the ground enough so we're not bottoming out. Because it's it's not letting me steer very well. It steers. Just not very well. Uh, okay, no, we didn't want to go over. Okay, then we just went over. That's great. Okay, there we go. Perfect. All right, here we go. So hoping just by putting these on the front. Well, after we get them off these crappy rims here <laughs> oh that's i want that <laughs> i don't want to get rid of that tire okay here we go yeah those these yeah so we just got to get some spray on those get them fixed up and then we should be able to i was hoping it would turn nighttime because i was hoping i would see the lights from the road but basically i gotta head in one direction and not turn um at least that's my plan Let's see here. There's some spray over there, too, so that'll work out. Okay, here we go. This one's really haggard, so we'll do that one first in case we run out of spray. I saw some spray over here. This is going to be an adventure today, boys. But we're still going to drive 50 kilometers. Whether or not we'll actually get anywhere, I guess we'll find out. But we're going to head off in a direction. It's got to be one of those two big rocks. It's got to be. <sighs> okay, here we go. Dead rabbits. There we go. Perfect. All right. So those are good. It's so going to take these wheels off. I like how it just sits on the engine. Like it's, it didn't even drop. Like it just sitting on the engine. Okay. Here we go. And bam. Hopefully that'll get it up just enough. If there, if I'm a little bit careful, it'll work. Okay. Here we go. Until I can find bus tires or something. Okay. Um, those should be a little taller, I think. How are we looking? Oh, it's still dragging, I think, but it should be a little bit better. It's too bad that bus doesn't have. So I'm going to head, I think, in that direction. See what happens. Oh, I can turn at least. Okay, that's, that's a little better. It's not great. It's still dragging a bit, but. 
So we're going to head this way straight as we can. And that way, if we screw up, we can just turn around and come all the way back. But I'm seeing a lot of stuff in the distance here. So I'm hoping this is the way back to the road. We started at three kilometers on the thing. And we're barely clearing the ground here, like just slightly. That I think I may have picked the right direction, possibly. It looks like, oh, it looks like the road. I see the road. I think I do. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Okay. This is very zoomed out. I realize and we're, we're doing our best here, boys. We got to poop and pee in celebration of this. There we go. Just, just pee and poop all over the interior of this car. Come on. Poop. There we go. Okay. So we got some poops in the car. Is that, did I see the road? I think that's, the, what was that? What just fell out of the sky? Did anybody see that? That's our door. That's one of our doors. Oh my God, that's, that's pretty crazy. <laughs> There's stuff's probably strewn across. Like, look at this. There's probably stuff all over this area from when the vehicle exploded. Okay, well, we did find our way back-ish. We'll zoom the camera back in here in a second. I'm just looking around to see if anything shows up. Yeah, this thing is just barely off the ground, so we're going to have to take it easy until we find something we can jack it up a bit with. Like maybe some more Fury tires on the rear. Okay, so... <sighs> Wonderful. Okay. This is, uh... This is great. Okay. Things on the left. Look at that. It's just barely off the ground. Look, so we got to be super careful about what we run over here. Okay, so let's uh, let's zoom back in a little bit here. Okay. I don't want to go too aggressive right now. The zoom is very slow, by the way. <laughs> I knew I'd find my way back to the road. I always do. Okay. Now, the frame rate's probably going to be a little weird in this episode because of the fact that it's um, at a 25 kilometer draw distance, which does impact frame rate quite a bit. Yeah, but look at this, eh? Like, that's just, just not touching the ground. So, we, we need the bus tires up front at least. That or a new vehicle we can slam this puppy into. Excellent. This is good. Whoa, rabbit. Get out of the way, bud. Ah. <sighs> You know, I didn't think I was going to make it. Uh, what did I just hit? And why did I just hit it? Is that just a rock? It stole my door. Why, why would you steal a guy's door? Like, I don't understand. Oh, wait a minute. Do I not have a radiator? Oh, this is going to get bad. Oh, God. Don't freeze now. Okay, Jesus. Jesus Christ. Shut your face, buddy. Okay. My engine's really hot. And I'm going to say it's probably due to the fact that I'm running the worst radiator in the history of mankind. You lost your mirror, bud. I'll fix that up for you. Here you go. You doing okay there, bud? Is everything all right? You wouldn't happen to have a... I'm going to borrow this, all right? I'll give it back at some point, I promise. Here, I'll give you this. We'll trade. Perfect. Okay. I just want this in here. Bam. Okay, let me see. Has this got a resettable one? Yeah, how many did I have on that now? Sorry, bud. I just need to... So that's 8.3. So that's... I've got about 5 kilometers. So let's... Uh... Can I, can I adjust this one? I don't guess I can. Okay, so I got to go about 45 kilometers. And shut up. 
All right, there's a lot of poop in the car right now. Dude, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. Jeez. We don't have any way to really tell what our heat's at. But that's all right. So we got to go about 45 kilometers on this odometer. Hopefully uh, it'll go. Look at this thing just jiggling around, eh? Excellent. I don't know what my, like I said, I don't know what my heat is. So we're going to figure that out. We're definitely coming into nighttime and we don't have any lights. This car is a mishmash and, a, and not a good one of every garbage vehicle. That's okay though. You know what? We're, su we're survivors. We'll make it. Oh, there's a, there's a garage coming up here, I think. Boy, this draw distance is incredible. And actually, the frame rate isn't as good as it was, but it's... Considering on my old computer on the 5950X, it would uh, chug. And this is not. I'm impressed. Whoa, 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 whoa. relax! Buddy, jeez, you don't ram a guy, especially from behind. Jeez. I just, I'm just trying to get, I know my lights aren't on. I'm trying to get to the stop for the night. I apologize. Maybe he's mad because I took his speedometer, but I gave you a new one, bud. There you go. Just head on by, buddy. Have a good one. Don't get in any trouble now. All right, we just got to pull in here for the night. I'm actually surprised this thing hasn't done a cartwheel yet, considering how low that engine sits. Okay, excellent, excellent. I don't know how much fuel I have either, but that's all right. Okay, all right. Put her off here and uh, now that I can see further in the distance, things seem a lot closer than they really are. Okay, okay. just slower down a bit here it's hard to tell what the distance is in this darkness oh god i can't see anything all right let's just park and break it on here uh turn the ignition off let's go inside and we'll sleep there we go no would be awesome a better radiator i think they all have the same cooling performance honestly but a bigger one would be nicer Oh God. Oh God. What is happening in there? Okay, let's see. We got those kind of wheels. We got whatever that is. That's just a regular wheel. We got lots of parts actually. This I think, I think this is a diesel engine. Or is this the diesel? One of those is a diesel engine, I think. Or it could be gas, I guess. Now, those radiators are all right, but they're... Oh. Oh, nice. This is all right. I wonder if I could get... Oh, God. I'm stuck. You can't get stuck in this game. Trust me. If you get stuck, you're going to die. 100%. Now, this wheel isn't too bad, but it's only going to give me three of the right-sized wheels I want. I don't see any other wheels that size. Huh. Is there anything on the roof? <laughs> we got a giant turbo up here. That looks a wee bit haggard, but we'll take it. Okay, what do we got for food in here? Oh, yes. Mm, give me that. Give me that goodness, man. Oh, yeah. Chocolate croissants. Like, this is like a gourmet restaurant. Nothing. Oh, bacon. Eat some of that. There we go. Taking this with us. Or not. Okay, that's cool too. Nothing else. Well, it'd be nice to have a fridge to stuff all this crap in, but. All right, let's see here. Um, Take this bacon and we're going to stick it. Where are we going to stick the bacon? Well, it's going in the back seat, I guess. Okay, there we go. Now, I definitely want to switch out. Um, ugh, I'll save. Uh, okay. This is not going to be the smartest thing I've ever done, but, uh, 
we're gonna somehow make this work okay excellent here we go all right so we got three tires that are all the same size and one tire that is not but it's gonna have to work for now okay let me see here didn't i have an itty bitty teeny weeny turbo on here i don't think i did actually okay let's uh attach that perfect see you around bud now i'm not you just need to calm down buddy is that a headlight oh that is a headlight but i don't really trust getting underneath that car not even a little bit okay well let's move on okay let's uh let's keep going what we got here we gotta go 45 kilometers we're at three this is a little misaligned but that's okay Well, the turbo's kicking in. <laughs> it doesn't offer a whole lot more power. Excellent. Nothing says love like 100 kilometers an hour. Excellent. Okay, this guy's catching up to me. Well, you know what? It's At least it's a steady pace. Yeah, but I'm getting out of your way. Here you go. I just don't like being on this rough stuff too much because I'm, I'm bouncing around. And that engine's going to get caught. Okay, there we go. Ah, perfect. We just need to... We, we have one mismatched tire here, but at least it's working. Is it me or am I pumping a lot of white smoke out of this? Like, is my radiator overheating? Or is it close to overheating? You can see that turbo spin and look. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. You know what? It's working right now. It's actually tracking straight considering the size difference in the tires. So I'm not going to argue too much with it. But hey, you know what? As long as it works. But I'm still concerned about the white smoke that's like coming out of it. But it's not overheating yet. I wonder if it's just on the verge of overheating. Or maybe that turbo was kind of like brown and rusty. I wonder if it's like leaking oil or something. What is that? Just stuff. Okay, excellent. All right. This is going pretty well. I got to I got to say, oh, there's a rock right there. Is that, is that a rock? No. Considering what I've been through, I I'm okay with this. Uh, just me in the open road as it should be but like I said I gotta be a little bit careful because you know this is gonna cause problems but I won't be able to go fast until I have bus tires again which I'm trying to avoid because it makes the car so tippy but this car is exceedingly slow and like I said you just know the way this is dragging it's gonna catch one day and flip like, that's just a given, right? There's a little gas station up here. What do we pull in? Maybe sometimes there's tires kicking around there and stuff, so maybe we can find a appropriately sized rear tire. Oh, God. Hey. Hey, truck. Yeah, bud. I'm going to get out of your way. Okay, I'm getting out of your way. I'm getting out of your way. Just relax. I'm relax. Call me Vu. Well, now you didn't even try to pass me. Let's just pull on in here. See you around, bud. Enjoy your time. Oh, look at that. Perfect. Oh, yeah, she's overheating. Look. She just wasn't overheating enough to cause a problem. Jeez, we're boiling water off. <laughs> Woo! Okay, nice. Perfect. Okay. Well, there's food here. 
So we need water, eh? And a better radiator, because this one's garbage. Well, what do we have here? This is gas. This is a, a rim of some sort. What's in here? Oh my god, water. We need to drink some of this, and the rest of it can go in the radiator. Yeah, that rad is not going to last. Perfect. Excellent. Excuse me, buddy. Can I talk to you for a moment? I just want to try to contact you about your uh, vehicle's extended um, warranty. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna borrow this temporarily until I find something better. Thanks. Is there any water in it? That's well, got seven and a half liters. Come on. There we go. And this should help cool it a bit. There we go. Oh, sorry, bud. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. No, 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 buddy. Buddy. Oh, God. Other bus. Yeah, just back up. That's fine. Here you go. Perfect. You're going to be fine. Oh, thanks, guy. Okay, here we go. Now, I've noticed there's a bunch of bus tires there that I don't want to steal just yet. And this tire isn't exactly in great shape, but it's going to beat this little one. At least it's the same size. So we're going to hop back in here. Where are we at now? Oh, geez, there's a lot of poop in here. Coily, Loggington, you doing all right, bud? Hey, Karen. Um, So we got 30 kilometers to cover on here. There we go. Wait a minute. I gotta put that hood, hood down. 35 kilometers to cover. <sighs> I guess that bucket can stay there for now. Oh, there it goes. Okay, excellent. Now, hopefully, that'll make the difference in the. Oh, we forgot to close it. God damn it. Can I get going, please? Jeez. Close it up. Perfect. All right, let's go. Excellent. Jesus Christ. There we go. This goes a little faster on the Fury wheels. Is it me or is it going up and down here? I don't know. It's sitting at about 110 when I don't turn. Perfect. Okay. Like I said, at least the tires are the same size. Although suddenly it's very hard to steer. Bigger tires, I guess. Well, tires that are... It's not designed for those tires either, right? So... If I could just get two bus tires for the front, just keep that front end up, I'd be happy. Okay, it's going better. I'm on a highway to hell. Dun, dun, highway to hell. Yeah, that little radiator was not keeping up. And, you know, that little coolant tank anyway. There you go, bud. Everybody passes the goat in his big diesel car. Speaking of which, I have not checked the uh, the fuel in a while. Now I see like a... Looks like a maybe a medium-sized shop over there. What do we got? There's a boat over there. I can go check that for diesel, I guess. Let's go, let's go take a boo. Because uh, people get upset when I pass ships for some reason, even though it's rather pointless. But we'll go check it out. Excellent. This is going swimmingly at the moment. 
Like I said, the ships are always deceptively far away when you don't realize it. But if we can get a little bit of diesel to fill top off the tank, that'd be nice. I do have extra diesel in there. That'll keep me going for a little bit. But I'm not going to carry around like a 40, like a 50 gallon drum of diesel. It doesn't make any sense. Not without a truck anyway, especially when you can't lock them down. They like to fly all over the place. Excellent. Here we go. I'm so glad you guys enjoyed my um, farming simulator series. I appreciate that. That a lot of people tuned in to watch that. Uh, I, I really enjoyed making that video. Oh, God. Can I even get in here? Oh, yeah. I can get in. Let's go check quick because it looks like it, it's about to turn nighttime and I don't want to be out here in the dark. Not with the rabbits. Lurk! Okay, here we go. Oil. Alcohol. Empty. Gas. Empty. Alcohol. No, no. Oh my god. Oh, diesel. Here we go. Perfect. Now, I know kicking these is a faster way to get things to places, but... I find when I kick stuff, sometimes it goes all crazy all over the place, and I don't want to have that happen with my fuel source. All right. I, wonder if I haven't checked the gas in a while. I was too busy dealing with my accident. Okay. Ah, we got lots. There we go. Yeah, diesel's a lot harder to come by than uh, gasoline. And it's not in every ship. Like, it's probably in half the ships you find, but you don't always find diesel. It's quite the commodity. If you want to run a diesel engine, especially a big one, like a bus or a truck. Now, if we get ourselves down to that four-cylinder diesel... That would be grand. Okay, let's just have a sleep here. Perfect. Excellent. You, know the, you need to have a good sleep. Preparing oneself for the long drive re requires lots of good sleep. All right. Jeez, I didn't think I was going to start there for a second. Excellent. Here we go. Now, don't be getting your engine caught on the ground, fool. It's just barely off the ground. Oh, geez. Excellent. Here we go. A lot of dents in the roof of this thing. Look at this. Looks like I got hit by a hailstorm. So what are we at here? So we needed 45, we said, right? Yeah, we're not doing too bad. 28. Excellent. You know, sometimes the game just works itself out. This is one of those times. This isn't the fastest I've ever done it because this car only goes so fast. I think the turbo is sucking down a bunch of extra fuel and only gaining me 10 kilometers an hour, but that's fine. We seem to be under boost constantly, so... And that turbo is just a bit big. But it's everything's working, and I don't like to mess with things when they're working too well. Like, people are always like, oh, change this and change that. It's like, dude, I'm trying to, I'm, like, this isn't a, like, I think people get the idea that I should play this, like, Komodo Gaming or Komodo Gaming or whoever plays the game and like be wild and crazy and still somehow make it to the end. It doesn't work that way. You either got to pick one style or the other. <coughs> this is my uh, this is my style. I like to make it to the end to make it make choices that uh, help progress. 
Oh, what was that? Was that a truck? Oh, God. <laughs> I just thought... Uh, you can't look away too long because cars like to spawn in when you're not looking. But this is good and consistent. Like, it's like keeping around 100, 110. It's doing its freaking job. I'm impressed that we actually found the road again. Considering the hell we... Carl, what's up, bud? Considering the hell we've been through... Oh, Carl. Jeez, bud, are you okay? I just lost my door for no particular reason. Carl, you can't just keep revving your engine like that. What was that? Is that a rabbit? It's auto-saving. I don't know where the rabbit is. There's a rabbit. Hang on, Carl. Just give me a second. Okay. Well, this is stuck in the ground. Dude. What? Carl, I won't let me put your wheel... Oh, there's a hubcap, isn't there? Yeah, here we go. Carl, 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 relax, bud. There you go. There's that. Now, yeah, dude, I'm doing it. Don't worry. Try that. Get going. Carl, stop running into the rock, Carl. Jeez, you forgot your hubcap, Carl. Never mind. It's my hubcap now. Okay, here we go. Perfect. All right. Hey, boss. Oh, you got dualies on the back. Nice. All right. Save that guy. No appreciation from Carl, I'll tell you that much. You come along, you save Carl from his own self, and then no appreciation for the work I'm doing out here. We do need to collect some spare parts, but lately we've been fighting the game more than anything else. Sometimes it goes like that, you know? Sometimes it be like that. <laughs> it's just... Ridi I know what it, it's just ridiculous. By the way, guess what I had for dinner? I had a lamb burger, and it was pretty good. I gotta say, me and Books enjoyed them. But this thing is just all over the road with these big tires on it. You can tell when a car is not made for the tires that it's wearing. Like when I see a Raptor, like a Ford Raptor at the, the Home Depot with 22-inch wheels on it with... Low profile tires, because that makes sense. It's like they'll be like putting mutters on a uh, GT3 Porsche or something. Jeez. This is good. It does. This is doing exactly what I needed to, and it's not overheating. I'm surprised it was still running. It must have been like just barely overheating. I would like to find an appropriate radiator, though. This is awfully large, and it's going to disappear because someones gonna, they're going to steal it back at the beginning of the next episode. Probably the uh, odometer as well. I've had a lot of stolen parts in my day. All my own fault. Carl's back there just doing donuts or something. Okay. <laughs> oh, Carl, you're just a card. There we go. 20 kilometers to cover. Well, roughly. Turbo's doing his job. Looks like we have two houses. Like, Not entirely sure. What happened there? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm going to chalk that up to the engine got caught. You know, I'm going to ditch the hood for now, because... <sighs> Crap, that sucks. Oh. Okay, okay, there we go. That's got to be the uh, the car or the engine is getting stuck. Did, did I hit something? It's got to be the engine getting caught, right? Okay. Okay. 
Jesus Christ, what is going on? I thought the engine locked up for a sec. Yeah, we definitely need bus tires, at least on the front wheels. Because this is this is really dangerous being this low to the ground. Also, some spray to get rid of all the blood that has literally sp splattered itself all over the the engine compartment. <laughs> okay. What do we got here? A lot of stuff out of the... Okay, let's uh, shut her down. Dude, put your, put your glasses back on. There we go. Is, are they back on? Excellent. Okay. So some weirdness is happening in the game. We definitely need something like this. Yes, 100%. And I think this will make a nice rear bumper for us. Yes, perfect. Okay. BBs, any food in this fridge? Because we're getting hungry again. Oh, nice. Oh, I got to poop. Okay, what are you? You are a compass, most likely. Oh, hello. Broken toilet, gun. Empty. Empty. Oh, God. Here we go. Ugh. Auto save. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Some spray would be nice. To Oops, I'm tipping over a fridge. Yeah, some spray would be nice to get rid of that blood all over everything. <sighs> Let's see here. No, no spray. That's what I'm looking for is straight up just spray. Weird game crash. <laughs> I had to reload an autosave. It just crashed out of nowhere. Um, but we're still just right here. Okay, how much further do I gotta go? Where'd my... Wait a minute, where's my... Where's my odometer? Um... When did I lose that? Okay, a little weird. Okay, there's little poops in here. I need to go. We got too many. We got too many poos in there. Now you can eat them, but they're not good for you. All right, here we go. Yeah, the game crashed, and then now I don't have an odometer. Is this is this what you're saying? You're not under the car, are you? What's this say? No, this is not. I don't see it anywhere. Oh well, we can make do. Now that car will have a speedometer. Probably not the one I want, but it'll have one. Dude, get out of here. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Oh no, that'll work. Okay, here we go. Ah. Get in there. There we go. Now what about, might as well take the other gauge. I think it's the right one for my car. Okay. Perfect. Now I'm wondering if I should like swap the doors and stuff because these are all the appropriate doors for my car. Oh no. This is good. This is good. We like this. Excuse me while I savage your vehicle for all of its proper components. I think we can just get rid of all this crap. Eh. It even has a, a, a deck lid on it. Nice. Take this. See, I like this. This is the way it should be. Take that. Oh, God, don't. Don't. Please don't. Uh, uh, uh. 
Okay, we'll put this on here like this. And then how about the trunk lid? Perfect. And then this. Dude, just get on there. There we go. And then we'll take this out. Get out of here for a second. Can we not take that out? I thought we could swap that out. Oh, well. It has lights, though. Look, see? Is that the driver's side light I just took out? Probably. Yeah. Signal lights on the outside. Makes sense. Nice. Okay. No, please. No. 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 I don't have time for your bullcrap, bud. We even have appropriate bumpers for it now. Perfect. And... A nice rear bumper on here. Oh, this is quite the find, I gotta say. Oh, now it feels like a real car again. All right, let's get up. <laughs> let's get out of here. Just don't let the engine get caught on anything. All right, I might skedaddle across the desert here a little bit. It's still dragging the engine though, and I don't like that. We definitely need to, because it's getting caught now, and it's it's causing me. It's becoming problematic, and I'm gonna end up dead if I if I keep uh keep driving it with this low front end on it. So we definitely need bus tires or something. But where are we going to get bus tires is the question. Well, a bus, obviously, but... It just, it really likes to get caught, so now I'm kind of nervous. So I'm just trying to take it easy. Why did, why is it shutting off? It's overheating, why? Wait a minute, where's my radiator? What the heck? Okay, what is going on? Like, did my radiator fall off back there? Oh, goodness sakes. Uh. Wait, why does it sound like nighttime suddenly? What is going on in this game? Oh my god. We had to cover 20 kilometers and we're at two now. Radiator must have fallen off and I lost that gauge for no reason. I just didn't notice. Good Lord. There, turkey. I'll just have to keep busted it up a little bit. So it can cool off and we'll just have to keep spiking the engine. Oh my god. Well, at least we have lights this time. Ah. Well, this isn't the first time we've run into not having a radiator. Oh, you know what it was? I had to load the game and they stole it back. That's what it was. Because the game crashed and I had to reload it. It totally, uh... Screwed me over. <laughs> it stole it back, you jerks! And I have no interior lights for some reason. What is going on? Oh, is it just because there's blood all over it, maybe? Probably that's it. Oh, well, let's just uh, continue. Oh, there's a little spot we could probably sleep up here. Well, we'll just we'll just let it kind of crawl along here, and then when it finally runs out of steam, we'll stop. Wait till morning. I forgot when you reload the game, they steal the crap back. Anything you stole from them, they steal back. 
Oh, well, you know what? It's my own fault. That's what I get for being a dick. Let's just pull off the road here. Put the brakes on. And have a sleep. We don't have a ton of distance to cover, but do it without a radiator is going to be difficult. Engine cooled off while I was sleeping, I guess. Okay. Well, maybe we can find something. There's a uh, gas station up here. I've actually been in this situation before in real life. I, nobody stole my radiator, but I had a bad uh, thermostat. I had to drive home. And I had to drive and stop and drive and stop. Turn off the lights here. Let's see. Well, no radiator. What is that? Is that a donut? Is that a piece of bread? Okay, we could probably eat that. Oh, magazine. Nice. We could use that. Oh, God. I got to poop again? Come on. Poop your brains out. Poop. Your brain's out. Poop, poop, your brain's out. Okay. Oh, autosave. Ooh. Oh, Jesus, that startled me. God. Unload it. There we go. Let's pick it back up here. Dude, and we're going to steal the ammo out of this one. There we go. We got all that ammo, and then we're going to drop. We're just going to go back to four and reload. Oh, no, four. One and reload. Why is that one now? Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Okay, here we go. You are gas. We don't need that. Is that a finger? What is that? Those are cigarettes. I'm not seeing anything here that's useful for us, but we'll continue on. So we're at five. We need 15 more kilometers out of this beast. Now I'm doing 120 for some reason. How is that a possibility? Okay, well, this is going great, as always. The last couple episodes of this has been really hard, man. <laughs> no winning here. So you got to keep doing it so we don't overheat the motor. Excellent. This is going, you know what, like things could be worse. I could have no transportation. But all we got to do is find a radiator and then we'll pee in it and then we'll go from there. So they get for stealing. There's a storm coming. We don't like storms. Come on, baby. Excellent. Now these don't usually have car parts on them, but I'll stop and check it because it'll give the engine a little bit of time to cool down. Unless there's something in the distance. I don't see anything though. Okay, let's just... Go up here and see what's going on. No, just a, oh, just a light. Okay, well, so this is where if you ever want to find one of the revolvers, they're usually in this. Okay, we're going to overheat. We're going to overheat. Come on, get the speed up. Get the speed up. Well, that didn't work out as well as I'd hoped. Well, great. We may be pushing this for a little while until the engine can cool off. Ugh. Better not come to any giant hills or we're in real trouble. Anything out here, maybe? Anybody see anything? I don't see anything. No buildings anywhere. Well, way out there, I guess. There's a, uh... 
double building way, way out there. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Stop. Gee, stop trying to start, you stupid engine. There we go. I don't like this engine hanging this low. This has become a problem. There's even blood, like, literally in the reflection of the car. Look at that. Oh, we're coming up to green. Maybe it won't be as hot. <laughs> That's the desert. Ugh, Jesus Christ. Just got to keep on keeping on, man. Tenacity. It's all about the tenacity. This is not a game you want to get if you're easily frustrated, especially if you're trying to accomplish something. If you're just going in it to mess around, you know, like go in and crash cars and break stuff and all that, yeah, it's fine. And then it's a perfectly acceptable game. But if you're going in it wanting to do well, you're going to have to uh, rethink your ability to push through certain things. Yeah, that engine is so low. I just need a couple of bus tires for the front and we'll be all set. Are we in a downhill? I think we're on a little bit of a downhill. Maybe not. Maybe. Well, it's, it's holding its speed. Let's give it a little more speed. Come on. There we go. Shut her down. We're over 100 now. There is, uh, there is a building coming up, which it looks interesting. <sighs> Just even a, even a crappy radiator that leaks would be better than nothing. And a couple of bus tires would be lovely. Well, bus tires and rims would be important. What is that? Is that a bunker? Bunkers are useless. They never have anything good in them. But let's hope this one breaks the mold. Besides, we can use a drink. And maybe there's some food there. It's good, though. You know what? Sometimes you need these things to keep you going forward. Ugh. Gotta persevere. This engine takes forever to cool off. Look at that. Just getting out of the red. On the plus side, we have 70 uh, kilometers an hour at the moment. I haven't seen any cars in a while. There we go. Come on, baby. Now we're going on the uphill, so we're going to lose speed a lot faster. But we're just about at this bunker. God, any, any radiator, anything would be nice. It is definitely rubbing and it's scaring me a little bit. There we go. Come on, baby. Just get to that bunker. Okay, is that a car outside? Oh, it is. But I don't think it has any parts. God damn it. Two cars and no parts. God damn it. Okay. Come on, baby. There we go. Okay. There we go. Perfect. I don't see anything. Is there food here, maybe? This fridge, possibly? Besides, that car could use a little... Oh, jeez, and crackers, man. What are you doing? Good. Okay, let's go check upstairs. Sometimes there's stuff up here. Frig. Okay, nothing good. Uh, I wonder if I should bring some water with me, just in case. 
in case I do come across a radiator. Three liters will do me for a while, but... There we go. We'll get three liters of water. We'll toss it in the car. So if we do find a radiator, we at least put something in it. Fill it up, buddy. Ah. Eight, nine, and zero. Okay. Whoa, buddy. Okay. We'll bring you with us. You cooled off, any bud? All right. Yeah, you're cooling off. All right, let's get going here. Again, hopefully we can find something we can... Find a bit of a, uh... Yeah, we're just overheating it constantly now. See, the problem is it overheats very quickly. And, uh... Doesn't come down in temperature very fast. Come on, baby. We don't have that much further to go, so we should be alright here. We only got six kilometers to cover. I like to keep that on so I can see what the temp of the engine is. And we are saving fuel, I guess, by doing this. Always look on the bright side of life. Alright, we're doing 40 now. Is this is this the downhill section? All right, well, you know what? This is just what it is. An hour of this is what this is. With one crash. Well, one game crash and then a bunch of other crashes. The one beauty of it, though, is that it gets up over 100 very quickly. Like, it, it accelerates like a maniac. Please don't get caught on the ground. It's the last thing I need. There's those moments where cars fall through the world a little bit. Uh, and I think when that happens, this engine gets caught very, very easily. Gotta get to the top of this hill. Just as it was about to overheat. Come on, baby. But like I said, there's good. I've, I've dealt with worse, like significantly worse problems than this. I think people, if you've watched, like, if you've watched every episode of The Long Drive, which I'm not expecting anybody to do that, but if you are, if you have, you'll have seen sometimes when I've, uh, like, there's a time I spilled all the engine oil out of my engine, and I had to walk across the desert, uh, to get, to find oil at a ship that I couldn't see because it was miles and miles away. And it took me, God, 45 minutes of walking through the desert. I actually did a time. It was one of my first time lapses I ever did. Because it was so long and boring, I just sped it up. Looks like we got something coming up here. Come on and off. There we go. I like I like this, actually. This uh, This keeps the game fresh. Looks like a small gas station, maybe. Yeah, it's definitely a small gas station. Maybe we can find something there. There we go. Come on. What's that out there? I don't know what that is. What is that? 
Is that a tower or something? What is that? I have no idea what that is out there. Huh. Part of me wants to go check it out, but... Is it a double building just at a distance, maybe? It might be worth the investigation. Let's go... Let's go check that out. Lights, please. There we go. I think it's just a double building, but... There's water at double buildings, which is nice. And sometimes buses or trucks get stuck here, so... Alright, and we're just about at where we needed to be, so that's good. Well, it's been a day, I'll tell you. Like, I, I never, it's, it's very rare the game gets, like, overwhelming, and today's one of those days. All right, let's stop in here and see what's up. Well, we'll have a nap first. Oh, that soccer ball's rolling. That's creepy. Okay, well. Yeah, and me here with an engine that runs. Nice. Let's get to morning, please. Okay. Uh, let's get on stretcher legs here. Not much going on here. Yeah, but we are at 20 kilometers, so we're going to end this episode right here. Uh, once I take a peek around to see if there's any radiators. Anything out there? I don't see anything. Nothing here except water. Okay, that's fine. <sighs> Mother-in-law door is up here. Right? This is mother-in-law door? Yes, it is. Okay. Nothing here. And we'll just double check up here just to see if there's anything up here we can use. No. And over there, we got a tire. Nothing good. Oh, well. Okay. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. It's been a fight, but we... Sort of, we're sort of doing better but uh, thank you so much for watching if you like this please leave a comment maybe subscribe maybe tell your friends to subscribe get your dog to subscribe your horse cows chickens all those things which way did I come from over here right um yeah I'm pretty sure it was over there and if you didn't like this well you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I'm not much of one thank you again so much for watching love every view I get scapegoat the apocalypse is starting out.